Prince Harry has been hailed in a proud announcement, as the royal is credited with assisting 3 million men with life-saving treatment. Before we continue, please if you are new here, just take a few seconds to hit the subscribe button to get amazing contents. In 2018, Prince Harry and Elton John launched Menstar Coalition with the intention of ending the AIDS epidemic by 2030. It goes to engage guys in new and modern methods to damage the cycle of HIV transmission. In a post from Elton John AIDS Foundation, it used to be published that the pair had trebled their initial goal. A spokesperson for the foundation tweeted. In the four years considering Elton John and Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, launched Men's Star at AIDS 2018, we're proud to announce that the Coalition of Companions have trebled our preliminary aim and enabled 3 million men to begin life-saving HIV treatment. 95% of these guys are now virally suppressed, which means they cannot omit the virus on. Men's Star has given us valuable perception into the boundaries to HIV remedy for guys and will assist in form future techniques on attaining the most prone communities. Royal followers have been praising the prince for his efforts, with one tweeting. This is the strength close quote another said. Prince Harry is worried with all matters appropriate and positive. Prince Harry and Elton John launched the Pounce One Billion Coalition at the AIDS conference in Amsterdam four years ago. Elton John has long been an advocate for ending the AIDS epidemic, with the singer launching the Elton John AIDS Foundation in 1992. The Men's Star Coalition is backed by a wide variety of organizations, consisting of the Children's Investment Fund Foundation, Gilead Sciences, Johnson & Johnson, PEPFA, the Global Fund to Fight AIDS, Tuberculosis and Malaria, and UNITED. Clifford M. Samuel, Senior Vice President at Gilead Sciences, said, The Men's Star Coalition is about partnership between fundamental public and non-public donors, between expert specialists from medication to distribution and customer marketing. But the most vital relationship of all is our partnership with humans at every stage of their HIV journey. We hear to them. We co-create packages with them. We assist so they can assist themselves. And we remember on them to share their trip with their peers. That it is feasible to be healthful and acquire all of your desires, regardless of your HIV status. Prince Harry has long been an advocate of putting off the stigma around the virus, with the Duke trying to proceed his mum's unfinished work. The Duke of Sussex publicly took an HIV check alongside singer Rihanna in 2016, with the broadcast contributing to a 500% amplifier and the variety of humans, asking for a test on the Terence Higgins Trust website. In February, Harry spoke with ex-rugby celebrity Gareth Thomas on the Tackle HIV podcast. He informed Thomas. Once you get to meet human beings and you see the struggling round the world, I truly cannot turn my back on that. He introduced that he felt he had an obligation to precede Princess Diana's intention to take away the stigma surrounding the illness. The late princess, who died in a vehicle crash in 1997, modified the international view of HIV and AIDS, elevating recognition of the situation and aiding hospices. And former Wales fullback Thomas, who published he was once HIV advantageous in 2019, said, It would not be frightening if you understood what living with HIV in 2022 is. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to drop your thoughts in the comment section, and please subscribe.